Welcome to Facts, the image you're looking at is not a military armored tank or any other form of war vehicle. It will surprise you to know that this is an actual gun and it is considered to be the biggest that has ever been built throughout history and that is going to be our topic for today's video. In many ways, World War II was the beginning of unbridled mechanized combat, and the development of this gigantic gun, popularly known as Gustav, added to that legacy. The Gustav was like nothing else anyone had ever seen before, at a whopping four stories high and weighing in at over 1,350 tons, the giant tank-like machine had destructive abilities that put it in a class of its own. Before we continue, we plead with you to support us by subscribing to our YouTube channel and turn on post notification. You should also connect with us by following us on TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram, as well as joining our Telegram channel through the links in the description or via the handles we inscribed in the images. When World War II began, Germany set its sights on overtaking its western neighbor, France. However, France's military defenses relied on rather archaic methods recycled from World War I, so Germany decided to get creative. France's only real defense against the German army was its Maginot Line, which was essentially a great line of fortifications that spanned France's borders with several neighbors, forming a glorified trench. The creation of the Gustav began with Hitler employing the expertise of the Friedrich Krupp AG company out of Essen, Germany, with the intent of developing a railway gun capable of devastating the French trench. The result was a four-story, 1,350-ton gun that was capable of firing off both 10,000-pound shells and 16,540-pound concrete-piercing shells, roughly the weight of an unladen 71-passenger school bus, traveling at 2,700 kilometers per hour. The device's precision was also remarkably high, it could hit a target as far as 29 miles away, and could break through as much as 264 feet of reinforced concrete with a single blow. In total, the Gustav fired off a little over 300 rounds in its lifetime before its bulky self unfortunately fell into the hands of the enemies and was eventually disassembled. If you enjoyed today's video and also learned something new, kindly give us a like and hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to also share your thoughts in the comment section and share our videos as well so as to enlighten others. Thanks for watching.